Hello. Hi, thanks again for joining me for another session of Move Your Body and Speak English. Today we're going to look at synonyms. Synonyms. So in the last weeks we were looking at homonyms, words that are, have same the same sound but have different meanings and different spellings. And now we're going to look at synonyms. So they're words that sound uh, that, that are different, uh, but the meaning is very similar. Here we go. So here we have an elephant. And a person trying to climb up the elephant. Got that the wrong way around. Here we go. It's a large elephant. Elephants are large. They're also big. They are big animals, elephants. So we have large and big. They have similar meanings. And that's to do with the size. You can see a pair of yellow shoes. Looks like they're running shoes or sneakers. And he's about to start a race. It looks like he's at the at the start line and he's crouched down ready to run a race. So he's at the start. He's about to begin a race. Begin and start a race in this case. That's what it looks like. Okay. Next. Here's an image of a father holding his son. It looks like a son, not a daughter. Although it could be a daughter, but to me it looks like like a son. And he is a dad. He's also a father. The father is pointing his finger at something. He's a dad. And there's his child. He's holding his child. And that's how we know he's a father. Because that's his child. And we have a an image of a house, it's a two-story house with a red front door, looks like some roses flanking the pathway to the house and two lovely trees and they must, they must have a fireplace because there's a chimney, you can see the smoke. Oh, 
Pops. There we go. The puzzle is fixed. <laughs> complete, complete puzzle. So there's a house and it's also a home. A house or a home. Well, there are cinnamons. Let's do a little movement now. So let's begin with taking some deep breaths. Let's make ourselves really big like an elephant. And now we put our hands together and that becomes the trunk of the elephant. And now let's imagine that it's really hot and that we're an elephant and we want to cool ourselves down. So we're going to take our trunk and we're going to squirt out water to cool ourselves off. Let's do that a few times. The trunk reaches up above and then our whole body has a shower. Do that on the side. And now we're going to be a father and we've got our child and we're going to rock the child. So we're swaying from side to side, changing the weight from one leg to the other leg and we're moving our elbows side to side as well. You can look up with your eyes. You can look down with your eyes at the baby. And then just make it a little smaller, a little faster. And let that go. Take another deep breath. Let's imagine that we're a house and we're a two-story house. So we're going to lift up and be very tall like a two-story house. And then we're going to bring it down. Let's do that again. Lift our whole selves up. Be very tall. Onto our tippy toes. And coming down. All the way up. Be very tall. Reach up and down. And last time, making ourselves like a two-story house, very tall. And down. Okay, well that's it for today and we'll see you next week. Have a great week. Bye for now.